heard a big bash and then a scream. It's the most unfortunate luck. A mother just walking down the street, mowed down by a van. Another man then hit by the ladder on top of the van. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Deborah Nam. And I'm Steve Dunn. That horrible crash happened in southeast Portland, 162nd and Stark, right during rush hour. Anita Kasey has more on a mystery car that might also be involved in this. One look at this van and you know it's bad. I heard a big bash and then a scream and I looked up and the van had crashed into the pole. That van looked like it was going pretty fast. Guy Cohn was across the street waiting to turn left onto Stark and watched the bridge communications van hit. I saw the passenger hit the windshield and the girl that was hit, she hit the ground just immediately. And she had a little girl with her too. It gets worse. Police say another man on the sidewalk nailed by a ladder off the top of the van. And he was cut. They were holding on the back of his head. But Cohn and another witness saw something a bit different during this Friday rush hour crash. There was another car that had gotten hit by a ladder that flew off the top of this white van. And that ladder was laying on the hood of that car as it turned the corner. It was kind of weird because they pulled into the gas station and there was a guy that carried the ladder, put it down, and they just sped off. Both say they thought that mystery car turned right directly in front of the van. You would think that they would stop and help. Especially considering at least four people were badly hurt. Two lying right there in the busy street. And this is right where that happened. This is that pull that that van hit. Now, at this point, police are not confirming anything that those witnesses told us. They say this is all still under investigation and at this point are not looking for another vehicle. The driver of that car, by the way, we are told is in good condition. The man who was hit by that ladder is also okay, but we have no word yet on the passenger, that mother, and whether or not that child was hit in all of this. Live in Southeast Portland, Anita Kasey, K2 News. Anita